Hello there, it's the Easy Engineering once again. For today's topic, we're going to talk about density. Take a look at these pictures. The picture on the left side has 4 children, while the picture on the right side has 6 children. Which one is more dense? Correct, the one on the right side is more dense. Now take a look at this another example. The parking lot on the left side has 10 cars, while the parking lot on the right side has 3 cars. So which is more dense? That's right, the parking lot on the left side is more dense than the parking lot on the right side. So based on the examples given, we can easily define density. Density is how much space an object or substance takes up in relation to the amount of matter in that object or substance. Scientifically, density is the mass per unit volume. Density is denoted as small letter d. Mass is small letter m and volume is small letter v. So the formula of density is equal to mass divided by volume. There are also books that use rho as the symbol for density. Now we all know that the boat will float in the sea and the coin will sink. But do you know what's the explanation behind that logic? The boat floats in the water because the boat's density is lesser than the density of the water. And the coin sinks because the density of the coin is greater than the density of the water. Though the coin looks tiny, coin has more density compared to water. I will just summarize it to make it simple. If the density of the object is lesser than the density of the liquid, then the object will float. And if the density of the object is more than the density of the liquid, then the object will sink. Now let's try solving problems related to density. Suppose you have 96.5 grams of gold and has a volume of 5 cm cube. What is the density of the gold? Now do you still remember the formula of density? So the formula of density is mass divided by volume. Now plug in the given values and the density will be 19.3 grams per cubic centimeter. Now for another example, let's say you have a diamond with a volume of 8 centimeter cube and a mass of 90 grams. What is the density of the diamond? So the density of the diamond is 11.25 grams per cubic centimeter. Now let me ask you some question based on the two examples given. Which is heavier, the gold or the diamond? The hint here is the word heavier, which refers to mass. Therefore, gold is heavier than diamond since gold has a mass of 96.5 grams while diamond has only a mass of 90 grams. Another question, which is more dense, gold or diamond? This question is asking about density. Based on the answers, in the example, we can conclude that gold that has a density of 19.3 grams per cubic centimeter is more dense than the diamond. These two questions show why it is important to be careful not to use the word heavier or lighter when you are asking about the density of the object. So now do you understand the concept of density, right? Good job! So that's it guys, hope you learned a lot about the concept of density. You can also watch other video tutorials here in our channel. Once again, this is Easy Engineering. We'll make engineering topics easy and fun for you.